Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if your Wi-Fi settings are not showing in settings on Windows 11. It would be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing I'd recommend trying would be to open up the Start Menu Search. Type in Services. Best match, you'll come back with Services. Go ahead and open that up. And then you want to locate the WLAN Auto Config Service. So you're going to have to scroll down near the bottom. And go ahead and double click on that. Set startup type to automatic and if service says to stop, you want to go ahead and start the service. Once you're done with that, go ahead and select apply and OK. Close out of here and you want to restart your computer. And now once you've restarted your computer, check your internet, see if that has resolved the problem. If you're still having a problem, you can also try opening up the search menu. Type in CMD. Best result, should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And now you want to type in NETSH space Winsock, W-I-N-S-O-C-K, space reset. Again, exactly how it appears on my screen here. Go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard. It should take successfully reset the Winsock catalog. You must restart the computer in order to complete the reset. Close out of here and go ahead and restart your computer. And then again, hopefully I would have been able to resolve the problem. One further thing you can try if you're still having an issue would be to reset your network settings. So you will need to have your Wi-Fi password nearby because once you restart your computer, you will need to enter that back in if you want to gain access to the Internet. So in order to actually start that process, we're going to begin by opening up the search menu and type in settings. Best result, should come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. And then you want to select the menu icon up at the top. And then on the left side, you want to select network and internet. You want to scroll down and select advanced network settings. And now you want to go and select underneath more settings, network reset, reset all network adapters to factory settings. This will remove and reinstall all your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards, such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. Go ahead and select the Reset Now button. Are you sure you want to reset your network settings? Go ahead and select Yes. And click on Close and close out of here and actually restart your computer at this point. And then hopefully once you try to connect back to the internet and you can just type in your password, that should be able to resolve the problem. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.